After a recent string of unrelated accidents, the Navy's top admiral is calling for a renewed focus on safety. Chief of Naval Operations Admiral Mike Gilday visited Naval Station Norfolk today. Mike Gooding was there. The sea can be a pretty unforgiving place. Danger tends to lurk around just about every corner. The Navy's top admiral says now is a good time for sailors to refocus on safety. Just last month, a Navy F-35C Lightning II Joint Strike Fighter crashed into the South China Sea, injuring seven sailors. The month before that, a Navy SEAL commander died following a mishap during a fast rope training exercise. The two events are completely unrelated. Still, Chief of Naval Operations Admiral Mike Gilday, visiting the USS Mason at Naval Station Norfolk, told reporters he wants for sailors to constantly be focused on being safe. You know, what do we really learn from that with respect to how we face day-to-day -day operations and how do we self-assess and self-correct on a daily basis? How do we debrief after every evolution that we have to learn what went right and what went wrong? Gilday is installing a two-star admiral who will report directly to the CNO to be in charge of the Navy Safety Command. We will do safety assessments at a deeper level across the Navy, so, so down at the ship level, the squadron level, the submarine level. Gilday also weighed in on what impact there could be upon readiness once the Navy starts discharging more sailors for failing to comply with the president's COVID-19 vaccination mandate order. He says he doesn't anticipate it will be much. We have not seen any kind of readiness impact to speak of that would cause me any concern. Mike Gooding, 13 News Now. The Admiral also spoke about the ongoing budget stalemate in Washington. Gilday said a year-long continuing resolution would be bad for the Navy because all funding would be frozen at the prior year's levels. The current CR expires February 18th.